Yo, what's up? So today I'm going to show you how to get overpowered in Skyrim really early by getting the Imperial Dragon Armor. Um, what you're going to need leaving the cave is some sort of um, set of Imperial Armor, or you're going to need to find one on the way to getting this. Um, but obviously if you start as Imperial, or start with Hadvar, you get the Imperial Armor, or you kill an Imperial as the Norden can get Imperial Armor. You're just going to need... Um, that and so the first spot you're gonna need to get to is to white run in order to get the quest all right now what you're gonna have to do once you get to white run is just gonna want to head over here to the drunken huntsman and there will be a note on the table that says battle of champions and this is gonna give you the quest battle of champions now all you're gonna need to do is go to solitude. This is where the imperial armor uh, comes in handy because it lets you pull, uh, pose as an imperial soldier. So I'll show you solitude. Alright, here we are in solitude and so what you're going to need to do is to go to castle dower. I'm just going to set this quest as active really quick. Um, so head up to castle dower. I have no stamina because I'm still level one. but you're just going to walk in like you own the place find um... the... oh what the fuck he's down in the barracks you know, run down and find the Leggett you're going to say you can handle the thing uh... he'll give you the key you walk in. Also, if you need the armor, there's an armor set right here that you can just steal. But, um... Yeah, and you're gonna get this whole set of armor here. So what you're looking at... There's also a Stormcloak version of this. Um, which I'm not gonna show, but it's, I'm pretty sure it's the exact same quest. Um... So as you can see, the enchantments on this armor are absolutely crazy for the early game. You are going to be really just set up. Even on Legendary, this armor can carry you pretty far before you're going to need any kind of upgrade. It's a really um, overpowered way to start the game. Um, and it even has a one-handed and two-handed weapon. So if you're a one-handed or two-handed player, you can use either of these. They're extremely strong, powerful enchantments that last a fair amount of time, and you're going to be able to go pretty far without having an upgrade. Also, the armor looks pretty cool. So this is in the new Anniversary Edition, and this is a really easy way to start your journey off, especially if you're playing on Legendary or something where things are kind of really tough in the start of the game.